Welcome once again to the Autodromo Internazionale Enzo e Dino Ferrari. The clue's in the name. This is very much Ferrari home turf, and the locals will be out in force today to support their team in what we hope will be a magnificent spectacle of motorsport. On then to the Emilia Romagna Grand Prix. 3.1 miles of track here at Imola featuring 19 turns, 9 to the right and 10 to the left. Remember that Imola differs from most other Formula 1 circuits as it's driven anti-clockwise. Let's hope no one forgets that today. The exit from turn 18 will probably be the setup for many of today's overtakes, leading as it does into the longest straight of the circuit and its only DRS zone. And as always, a man with plenty of racing experience joins me in the commentary box. Today, it's Anthony Davidson. Tell me, Ant, you're no stranger to surviving the melee of Turn 1. So how do you keep out of trouble when there's so much going on around you? Well, the throttle goes both ways, Crofty. You've got to have the discipline not to try and win the race on the first lap. So always be prepared to lift early and give those around you more space. Trying to be the last of the late breakers with half a dozen cars around you may pay off from time to time, but it's also a great way to lose your front wing. It's time to see how our drivers are stacking up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session. Iceman lines up on pole position and Max Verstappen lines up alongside. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Hamilton, Perez, Charles Leclerc and Sainz, Ricardo, Fernando Alonso, Gasly and Esteban Ocon. Bottas, they'll be starting further back after an earlier grid penalty. Vettel, Lance Stroll and Russell. Tictum, Sonoda, Nicholas Latifi and Lando Norris. They've taken a grid penalty. Giovinazzi, Mick Schumacher, Raikkonen and Nikita Mazepin. And with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. Four laps of fuel remaining. We'll be seeing at least 20 minutes of light rain. This is your final lap, final lap of the race.
guys, guys, you've been great all weekend. Thanks, guys. Absolutely fantastic. It's a brilliant result. Well done. They take the chequered flag then here in Imola in what has been another outstanding Grand Prix. And talk to me, what do you think it was that sealed the win for them? Well, keeping their tyre temperatures up in the tricky wet conditions was really important. There's not much grip out there at the best of times and it's ten times worse if you're out there on cold tyres. So the way they kept the rubber in its proper operating window was a huge advantage today. The faces on our top three look so incredibly happy as they make their way up to the podium. A much-deserved victory and a brilliant performance from them all.